Mortal Kombat X is here, and so is one of the first fight pads to come to current gen systems. And that's a pretty big deal. We got our hands on the Mortal Kombat X fight pad, and here's what we thought. The fight pad features a precision D-pad, six micro switch face buttons, and was designed with fighting games in mind. But if we learned anything from our time with this fight pad, it's that just because something is first, doesn't necessarily mean it's best. The controller is super light, mainly due to a lack of any rumble features, which causes a sort of melting feel in the hands. The handles were well designed, with the left one made longer for extra support to the hand controlling the D-pad. The right handle is shortened, giving maximum coverage of the six face buttons. The spacing is about as good as it gets for a controller with six face buttons, but it will take at least a few rounds to get used to the feel. The D-pad doesn't feel as well made as the one on the DualShock controller, but besides a small difference in the feel of the physical quality, the D-pad is completely serviceable. The six face buttons feature micro switches that require very little pressure to activate. This will allow you to get in and out of combinations quicker than ever before, but the downside is it brings accidental stray button activation into the picture. This problem is easily remedied by a few long playing sessions with the device, which we're sure you'll have no problem doing. The shoulder buttons are large and supply a satisfying click, although the structure that supports them can actually feel a bit hollow at times. The options and share buttons are tucked on top of the controller, away from the button mashing madness. All in all, PDP's controller is a decent effort to bring a fight pad to current gen. Although it's super light, it still has a nice feel to it. The different lengths on the handles definitely take some getting used to, but like all things in gaming, once you get playing, you get the hang of it. Is it a must have? Maybe not if you're an expert with a DualShock or an Xbox One controller, but if you're trying to take your Mortal Kombat X play to the next level, this is definitely worth a look. For more hardware reviews and everything Mortal Kombat X, check out shacknews.com. Thank you.